Hi guys, AJ here, and today we have something in a small box from Pulp, which is on Amazon. So I'm going to open it, and you can see what's inside. Check it out. something that I've been looking to get for a little while now so I'll put a link up in the description somewhere or wherever so here we are nice leather I smell it mm, smells like leather so it could be leather got these little leather hearts here so it's a nice little packaging bit of paper whatever that's for and then obviously you've got an annoying thing there that's not very good you haven't got a pair of scissors Genuine leather, it says there. And that looks really nice indeed. So let's just get a pair of scissors. Cut this off. So it goes in zibbing. Now we need to get an Apple Watch, which weirdly enough I have one here. So this case you know, I got from somewhere on a website. That is not Amazon and it's not eBay. Similar to eBay, but I think a little bit more reliable than eBay. Um, so here we go. So we have, oh God, I've forgotten how these work now. So we have this bit here. Which is that? Oh. So we have, yeah, so there we go. So that looks much better. So there we go. So that looks the nuts. So let's try and get ourselves a nice, decent watch face. Does that look good? I think it does, doesn't it? That looks nice. So let's try it on. Looks the bomb. So there we go. So that does look pretty nice indeed. As you can see, uh, there. As you can see there, that does look pretty nice. Bish bash bosh. And there we go. So I've got another one coming on Thursday, tomorrow. Um, which is more like an orange colour. But that really is nice quality. You've got a good strong buckle there as well. That is just so good. And I've got this for just under £15 on Amazon. So I'll put the link in the description as well. If I can get it off. And there we go. That looks absolutely wicked. I'm really proud of that. So as you can see though, even though I've got uh, grey space grey boring colour and you've got the buckly bits that are black it still actually goes with it pretty well indeed so that is really nice um really good very nice indeed so you've got the stitch in there nice stitching and then you've got the darkness there so this one is the retro walnut and then i've got an orange effect coming um like i say later on this week so once that gets a little bit more wear and tear, I think that'll actually look even better. It'll give that sort of ragged look to it. But that feels nice as well. It's quite thick. It's all thick around here, as you can see. So I think that's going to last quite some time. And that does look absolutely pucker with that face. Um, not bad. That's quite nice as well. So yeah. So... Guys, please rate, subscribe. If you have any comments, don't be shy to, to put whatever you want to say about my videos. It's totally up to you. It might help me to make better content. But if you've got any ideas or anything like that, I've got some more videos coming on my favourite apps on the Apple Watch and the iPhone. And I'm also going to do a compare with my watch 
the uh, Apple Watch Nike Edition 4 and also my wife's Apple Watch SE in gold. We're going to do a compare on that um, and the differences, what the differences are. So I'll find out what they are. I'm not too sure myself at the moment and I'll go with that. So I've got a couple of videos coming up. I've also got the one that I'm still editing about Apple CarPlay, which I've got a few questions there from a bloke named Kevin. Um, and hopefully, you know, I'm no expert, but hopefully I'm right on some of those. So anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Please rate, subscribe. Thumbs up is always a good thing. And uh, I'll catch you all real soon. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.